Hello there. What's going on YouTube? Darth Burn here bringing you guys another brand new video. And today we're going to be doing something very special. Going over the brand new Minecraft DLC Star Wars pack. And today I just wanted to go over this because it's two of the main focuses on my channel. With being Star Wars and Minecraft that I, you know, derive my name from and my kind of the branding of my channel. And so today we're going to be reacting and reviewing the trailer. And as always, you can follow me on any of my socials up above. Um, my Instagram, you can follow me specifically on there. Keep you up to date on all the, all when all my videos go live and, you know, whatever. It'll, you know, it lets you know what I'm playing at the time, whether it be um, Pokemon Go, Pokemon Sword and Shield. Minecraft and Star Wars content hopefully coming soon and for now let's get going in this, into the, the trailer here unfortunately I'm not going to be able to play the sound for you guys um, just out of copyright just to be safe out of copyright although for a small channel like me it probably doesn't impact too much if they muted the sound but any you know any precaution is a necessary one right now as YouTube's really cracking down on um, the no copyright right now and let's get it started All right. and it <laughs> Millennium Falcon tie bombers galaxy with excitement in every block Utini. Yavin 4, Endor, the Razor Crest, Cara Dune, help me Obi-Wan, yes, no, <laughs> dude, Make your own Star Wars adventures. Snowball fight! Woo! Let's go. That looks really cool. Alright, so first of all we started on Tatooine, which is just going to be your basic desert biome with you got the little land speeder here overall I'm really excited to um, play this just f trying to figure out how I'm gonna download it so far and um, because you have to play the mine coins and currently I do not have any of those not really sure if you only have to buy them or what the deal is with those <coughs> And then we have this shot of the Millennium Falcon with the A-Wings and the, the X-Wings. Probably um, right here is the battle of the first Death Star. And then we see this shot right here um, of a few Death Stars. And then we have the Imperial Cruiser here on the bottom. Galaxy with excitement in every block super super exciting and you know along with this they have I think like 30 something new skins that you can use and then we have the sand crawler here got the sand crawler with the uh, the, the Jawas Houtini then we have this shot of um, of Vader and the first first Death Star and I'm assuming with uh, with all this uh, new footage and uh, movies um, content they have to work off of, they're going to have original trilogy, sequel trilogy, maybe not the prequels. I haven't seen any footage of that. And then obviously the Mandalorian and everybody's favorite uh, Baby Yoda or officially named The Child. And then we have some shots from Yavin 4, and then we're going to go back to Endor. Maybe we'll have a little speeder bike race that you can do instead of maybe 
like a boat obstacle course. We have a speeder bike obstacle course. And now we're getting into the Mandalorian a little bit here. Where we first met Cara Dune and Mando. Recreate scenes from the original trilogy. Here we go. So it looks like maybe we might have a, a little bit of a story mode here. Or simply just be able to recreate these scenes like you would like they had in the movie where Leia's talking to R2 here saying Obi-Wan you're my only hope um, old man Ben and Luke the first um, first uh, major fight scene here between Vader and Luke as we all knew Luke is gonna get his uh, his hand chopped off here and he's gonna say no when he when Vader tells him that he is the he is his father then we had um, Jabba's palace more stuff about the Mando and uh, the infamous Razor Crest uh, this looks like um, season or episode the final episode of season one Oh, but there we go, the child and his egg. Maybe we'll be able to do a little E.T. action like they did in the in the show. And, of course, you can create your own. And maybe instead of tying up uh, an A.T.S.T., you can throw, just throw snowballs at it. All right. Another shot of the Imperial Cruiser. Pro looks like um, on a Death Star... Uh, not the Death Star, but um, a Star Destroyer. And then the final uh, shot here, we have Han and Chewie jumping into hyperspace on the Millennium Falcon. And uh, that's going to be all for this. So overall, the um, the trailer looks pretty solid. It's just... Um, We'll see what the, I mean, Minecraft always knocks it out of the park with these, these collaborations. They've always, um, you know, they're coming out with such great ideas recently with the, the Smash Bros and even, and now the Star Wars DLC packs that they're doing, which are really trying to do these collaborations to hype up, uh, hype up Minecraft once again, but it really never fell off. And as someone, I'll admit, not playing. Uh, Minecraft very much this definitely reaches out to more than just Minecraft fan base and you know jumps over to these other franchises where they can you know bring in even more fans to Minecraft itself and so in conclusion we got here I'd say this is a 8 9 out of 10 just with all the possibilities and the the new skins and everything else that comes along with the DLC pack. Although you might have to spend, it's probably around uh, like seven to ten dollars. I think is the uh, the payment you would have to use for um, buying the mine coins to unlock the DLC pack. But other than that, it looks super fun, and I'm looking forward to playing it. Hopefully. Um, I can play it on PC so far. I've only seen that I could do it on, um, like the main thing is Switch and Xbox, but I'm sure there's a way to do it on the Java Minecraft. Just um, so yeah, I'm looking forward to playing it. Definitely makes me want to go play Minecraft even more. And yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys haven't already, go. Um, Go like, um, subscribe, even dislike helps out the channel, um, any activity on the channel, not just views, because the way YouTube's algorithm works is we want to get as much um, activity on this video as possible, so that way it, it works its way into the algorithm and gets more traction that way. Yeah, that's um, pretty much it guys, remember, follow me on all my socials up above, and down below in the description, I'll have um, the link to my Twitch. Maybe I'll link my Instagram as well. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.